Well, Natini is a name you may be familiar with from an earlier review. This also has a happy squirrel. So this is Chocolino. We're going to set you aside and leave you in the background there for a moment because um, I need to ask something. I need to ask if you can subscribe to my channel. Because um, I have to ask. Because if I don't ask, you may not. It, it may not be a thing that anyone goes for. Who knows? But I have to ask. Please, ta, match me, thanks. You can also share, like, and comment. And if you're going as far as subscribing, there is a notification bell down here where you can get notifications of when videos become live. Thanks much, Lee, if you can. So, Latino, Chocolino, Creamy Hazelnut. This is going to be closer to um, a, a very familiar looking Kinder product now, isn't it, than the previous one? Yeah, Quin Kinder Bueno. Um, the other one wasn't quite similar, so I'm hoping this looks a bit closer because it's got three twin bars and the other one was single bits. And if you need to know what's found within, maybe I should read it across the top here and you can catch an, a glimpse of the product, which is also in very similar colours, strangely, and it's vegetarian. So that is good. A few vegetarians. And probably other people as well. Who are not vegetarians. Because who'd want beef in their chocolate? So we need to crack this one open to reveal another packet. I don't think these are individually wrapped in here. I don't think. But here it is. Here's a single packet. I wonder if any, where sells these single packets in the wild? Hmm. Probably think some more crimply, crackly, packagey, opening noises. I can do this. I can do this. I can't do this at arm's length. It's, it's awkward. Hmm. Interesting. You can't see what I was going to say. So, this is a twin bar, literally, so you've got two stuck together. Well, it does kind of show on the front, I, I, I didn't even catch sight of that, so a little bit different. Still smells hazel, nutty and chocolatey, so I need to crack pieces off, that's what it looks like if we crack it off, I'm not going to cut it in half because it's going to be a mess. Yeah, not bad. We'll pop you to one side because we need to pop you back in the pack because um, I've only got one set of hands. So, hmm. Definitely really kind of hazelnutty. So, time to dive in. That's what it looks like inside. Hmm. Definitely closer to a Kinder Bueno. It's closer. Mm. I think the the cream is a bit more solid. Obviously, it's not got Kinder style chocolate. Um. Hmm. Not bad. A lot better than the previous one. Previous one was just the wafer with no additional chocolate and whatever was inside. The extra chocolate coating pushes this up a notch for sure. So if you're looking for as close as you can get to a Kinder Bueno clone, this happy squirrel here on this particular packet may well provide it for you. But do let me know in the comments below if you've tried this one. Yeah, that's not bad. Not bad at all. But I would say I'd always go Kinder Bueno straight off the bat. Because superior product, obviously. But not bad. Not bad at all. Well done, Squirrel. Well done. 
thanks for watching. Please do the things from earlier in the video if you can. That's cool. And um, I shall see you in another video. There'll be another video coming up tomorrow. It will be something nearby to me here. Um, I don't know what it is yet. So you have to find out tomorrow. I'm going to find out sooner than you. But see you tomorrow.